Okay guys, so what we're going to do now is um, we're going to add a timer feature um, to the app um, and the idea is that when the user is on the sort of quiz question screen um, some of the levels will have like a, a countdown timer, so a time limit. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm not going to add the time limit to this screen that we've done already. Um, I'll leave it to you to kind of incorporate what we learn here into whatever screens that you need the timer for because you might not need the timer in every screen and it's going to be down to you. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add another screen, uh, let's call it screen three. Okay, um, let's get rid of the title at the top. I'm just going to make my timer here. Okay, so it's just essentially showing you how to make the timer and then you can just incorporate that into um, wherever you need it. So what I'm going to do um, in terms of layout, just put in my horizontal arrangement um, <clears throat> with fill parent, just to make some space at the top so it's more in the middle of the screen. Um, another horizontal arrangement. Um, width all the way, uh, make the height a bit less, um, 50, 100, no, 75, <clears throat> something like that. <laughs> um, and then we need a label in the middle of there, and this label is going to be our actual um, countdown like value. <clears throat> so um, size-wise, fill the parent and we want it to be in the middle so I need to come back to this one and align it all to the center okay font size wise I want that to be a little bigger and I'm just going to put in a number like 10 so that's he'll do um, so it's a nice big countdown timer here. Um, so that's our label. I'm going to rename that. Um, remember, we've got to rename things properly for when we come to do the code. Um, clap time label. I'll do. Um, underneath that, I'm going to put in another label. Width all the way across. Um, turn this up. It's about 30. Align to the middle, and this is going to be our label that's going to tell them they're out of time. Um, so out of time. Maybe put an exclamation mark there. <clears throat> that's fine. Um, and then at the bottom. Um, have a horizontal arrangement and I'm going to put a button in there which will be like a, a try again button so there's our button let's make sure everything's centered button I'm going to rename try game button Yeah, it should be fine for now. Again, you know, as with all the other screens that we've set up, in terms of the, the look and the design, that's all down to you. Don't just do yours boring like mine. Um, and actually, this is going to be incorporated into another screen, so yours will look a bit different. But these are the features you're going to need. Um, I think that's about it. Yeah. So we just got this is where things are going to count down. This is going to pop up if you're out of time. Um, and um, that says says text still. That's not good. Well, that needs to say try again. Okay. Great. Nice and simple video. Um, in the next one, we will set up the code for it.